Hey, a pleasant good day everyone. This is Sports Fanatic News. I'm Joe Boric and this is going to be a video on the big contract for the big kahuna Brady Kachuk getting extended by them Ottawa Senators on a very smart move by the Senators in order to extend them for seven years, 57.5 million. Still waiting for the full registration to come in according to Cap Friendly, but that is at what is reported now before it becomes official. Good job by Pierre Dorian to get it done. And the other side of this that I'll talk about in my team preview on the Ottawa Senators coming up soon is the draft picks you have to use for trade bait or to use to get more young talent. Because you, of course, now have Kachuk locked up, who joins that leadership core, of course, of other fellow youngsters, of Tomas Shabbat, Tim Stutzla, Drake Batherson, and Josh Norris, who are all very good players. The the other ones other than Shabbat are not even close to the prime age, yet Shabbat's just entering his prime age at 24-25 right now. So this is great for the Senators. Um, Kachuk last season led the team in points, of course, having 36 points. He also ranked second in shots on goal with 226 in penalty minutes and second in hits, 248. This dude is a big boy. He's going to abuse you on the ice. He's going to get in front of the net. He's going to also be just a good, efficient skater. He takes good stride. He moves quicker than you would expect somebody at his size. Plus, he's a great neck front presence, hits you on defense, and is going to consistently get better and better on defense as a whole in terms of just the foundational pieces of being structural on defense and not just relying all on your skill. And that is going to happen over time. Brady Kachuk has already been very good on both ends, and obviously he's going to be a absolute, absolute, absolute gem in his career on the offensive end. Yes, that did need that many absolutes, because that's how ridiculous and how disgusting the Kachuk brothers are, and Brady's the bigger of the two. He has skating ability, and he has size, and he has a brilliant shot. This guy is going to be one of the stars in the league for years to come. This is a very good contract. For the Buffalo, or not for the Buffalo, for the Ottawa Senators, as long as I'm concerned, as far as I'm concerned, and that adds to the other, like I said, young group that they have already. I also should throw Shane Pinto and Alex Fermentin into that young group of people they have already. You have good young budding talent in this Buffalo system, as well as Philippe Gustafsson in net. So this is a good move to keep that young core together, to keep that young budding group. That is only a couple years away, I would say, honestly, from being striking. Because this team looks sexy with these young names on the um, pause, but like on the roster. They have a lot of sexy names on the roster that are really going to help you in terms of expediting this rebuild process. And maybe being one of those 500 teams next year even, and maybe closer to it this year than you would even expect. And then building off of that. It's all going to depend, obviously, because Anton Forsberg is a limited goaltender. It's all going to depend, obviously, on what Philippe Gustafsson's able to do with Matt Murray when he's able to come back in, and especially what the hell Matt Murray's able to do. But I'll talk about that more in my season preview on the Ottawa Senators. When it comes to Brady Kachuk, this is an absolute beautiful move. It averages $8.214 million. The guy, again, can skate, he can score, he can shoot. He can set up at the one time of hell if he wants to, but why would he do that? Because he's so huge and so good at deflecting the puck. But you can have him pretty much do... He's a unicorn. You can have him do whatever he wants to do. He has great size. He has good ability on both ends. And he's just one of those great net front presence that is going to be there for years to come, but also be more than that and just be a guy that ain't afraid to shoot, ain't afraid to take the body, and ain't afraid to block the shot on the other end and give up his body for his team, either leading by example. So you got a great future leadership group, young core there in Ottawa after this move, and you also just have a potential future captain. It's probably going to be either him or Shabbat, so you have to see as time goes on what happens there. But when it comes to the general manager, Pierre Dorian, as I close out this video, he said, this is an exciting day for the Ottawa Senators. Brady possesses a very dynamic skill and is a prototypical power forward in today's NHL. He scores goals, plays physical, and he exemplifies what it means to be a pro for all players in organization. So that speaks to what I was saying. Great leader, a guy that leads by example and plays well on both ends and is the prototypical this generation power forward that's going to make him strive 
to be the best. He also has that attitude, I should say, that makes him strive to be the best each year, and that's going to make him be one of the best each year in the league for years to come. Hands down, great move by the Ottawa Senators coming into this season, giving their fans some great news before the season kicks off tonight. Stay tuned for my Senators season preview coming up soon. Subscribe down below if you like the content or up above on the easy-to-use widget. Peace out and stay safe, everybody, and good luck this year, Senators fans. You locked up a great one in Brady Kachuk.